What is going on YouTube? It is your boy Doom and welcome back to another movie review. Man, this one right here, I took my time getting this one out, bro. Because I was debating, I was like, do I want to do spoiler? Do I want to do non-spoiler? But well, we're going to go ahead, and as you see by the title, it's going to be a spoiler movie review. And today we got everything, everywhere, all at once. And man, I just want to go ahead and start, bro. This is one of the best movies ever been made. Off concept alone. Off, how, off concept and execution alone. That's what this is one of the best movies ever been made. Then you throw in the cast, uh, you, and then you throw in the acting, bro. Like, <sighs> okay, let's just, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to go step by. I'm gonna try to get as much as possible. I'm not gonna get everything because I need to see this shit again. I only see this shit once. I need to see it again. But I had to go. I literally had to go out of town to fucking watch the movie because my theater sucks near me. But um, so yeah. Everything everywhere all at once. It's basically it's like a new it's they're kind of like a new a new concept on like the multiverse type shit, right? So basically, I forget the name of the main what was it? Oh, I almost had it, I almost had it. I forgot I forgot her main her main name. But the main character, and it's the actress that played um the aunt of Shane Chi and Shane Chi. Uh, Legend of the Ten Rings. That that's the main character in this one, and you know basically you know you, you see her life or whatever. You know they're uh, they run a, a a laundromat and shit, and they're struggling to make uh, ends meet and stuff like that, right? And um, you know she's all about her husband, you know trying to get her to like, you know be loving and shit, like be be more loving, be more you know into relationship. Well, the marriage, you know, they got a daughter and shit. And he's about to, so he, he's literally on the ring. He's, he's saying, fuck it, that's I'm about to divorce you. Fuck it, bro. I'm just not happy. All this shit, right? And um, so, yeah, you see her going through her ordeal and shit like that, bro. And then, you know, then shit get real. And you see her husband, like, kind of, how, how, do, you, how do you say this? Kind of like, he kind of like starts to spaz. And then, it's like another version of him takes over. And he's like, yeah, 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 yeah. We got to get you the fuck out of here. Like, niggas coming to kill you. And shit like that. And she's like, what? You know, she's all confused and shit. And um, he's like, yeah, 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 yeah. So, so you created, in this universe, you created this device that lets other, this like, that lets other variations of you, like the consciousness of, of, other, vari of other variations of you, take over their or your body or whatever like that. Like you, but you have to do something like kind of out of the blue to make it happen. Like one one thing dude did is that he pulled out, what, what was it? Was it lip? Was it, it wasn't, was it lipstick? Or is it glue stick? It was, I, I forgot what, whichever one it was. He pulled it, he pulled it out, pushed it all the way up and he ate it. And as soon as he ate it, he 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 started kicking everybody asses in the office. So it's like basically, if you want to acquire a skill or whatever from a, another universe that that you are, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's still you, right? But you want to acquire that skill, you gotta do something to trigger it. And there's like one scene, she was getting chased and shit like that. And she, you know, she put on. You gotta have a device on though. You gotta put in the device. And there's this one scene. She she had to. Uh, she had to like she had to tell somebody tell the enemy you know pure person is trying to kill her really, I, I don't I'm not I'm not not name dropping I I don't remember half of the names it was like she, I was trying to follow along with the concept I don't remember half the names fuck the names, but she was she had to say to the to the person trying to kill her I love you, like and really really mean that shit she tried to do it one time and it fucked her whole her whole mental up she went to like her consciousness like transferred to another another uh universe she was like she she like got sent her consciousness got sent to another uh variation of herself instead of her getting this getting the uh consciousness into her you know what i'm saying like into her body right then and there she like got sent and i'm trying to explain as best as i can you gotta watch you gotta watch this movie even if i'm a, even even if, though this is a spoiler and i'm a, and i'm spoiling this shit bro i'm i'm telling you i'm probably won't even get to half of what this movie does and uh 
yeah, as soon as when she got it right, she really meant it. I love you and shit like that. Then she literally, literally got the skills of of a, a, a variation of herself, kung fu, uh, kung fu master, right? Martial artist, like like laying hands, <laughs> and it's crazy. Then comes to find out, her daughter, like they, I, I guess that was the prime. You know, if you like DC. DC, DC and Multiverse has like a Prime Earth, Earth Prime, right? I forgot what they called it. They didn't call it Prime Earth. They called it something else. But that was the Earth where she invented the device on, right? That lets you uh, pull from your uh, pull from your other consciousnesses, your variations of yourself, right? And it turns to find out she experimented on her daughter. And her daughter, she literally, is, she pushed her daughter so hard and now her daughter is literally everywhere all at once. That, that's the second part. Everywhere all at once. Her daughter is literally back, back here, back there. She might be uh, five universes over. You know what I'm saying? Like parallel universes. Like you know what I'm saying? But she hears it all. She hears it all at once, and she can't like drown out. And you and you see it because when her daughter comes. And she finds out, you know, she finds out it's her daughter. Her daughter come, come to kill her. And, well, she wasn't coming to kill her, but that's real late on. But her daughter came, she just wanted to get her, you know what I'm saying? Her daughter came, and as she's fighting, who was she fighting? She fighting the security guard, whoever she was fighting. Fighting, literally, she, weapons popping up. Uh, and it, <laughs> it's one of the best things. Weapons, uh, random weapons popping up in her hands. She, you don't know where she, she literally just pulled, like, like she pulling the shit out of thin air. Her costumes changing almost every scene and shit like that is because she is everywhere all at once. She's all of all variations of herself all at once, bro. Can you, I just want to take it take a minute and y'all comprehend that? Can you imagine being? Uh, I don't even know how many parallel Earths or parallel universes, wh whatever the fuck, however many it is. Could you imagine? Say it was say it was twenty parallel Earths, you know, where it has a U on it. Can you imagine being? On all twenty of those Earths, being aware of where you are, and on all twenty of those Earths, bro, at the same time, like your the main you, your main consciousness might be on this Earth, but your ass on the other Earth is in that Arctic, and you feel every bit of cold in that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like that is that's wild, bro. That is wild, and it's kind of crazy. There's like technology, if te you know technology do some shit like that. Cause they got, they do have. Now nah, I'm not saying like we gonna get anything like this, but I'm just saying they do. They got technology to preserve, you know, preserve your mind and your your uh, protect your brain and shit like that. Shit like that. I'm not now. Nah, obviously, I don't. I don't think it's gonna get nowhere like that. But can you imagine if it does though? That's like that's unprecedented, bro. That's like first of all, it it it, it, it shouldn't happen obviously because of some shit like this. You know, I'm gonna continue. I'm getting sidetracked. I'm gonna continue. So, um, what happened? Oh my God! It's like a little blank space. I'm I'm missing a huge chunk of the movie, but she starts the mo the daughter takes the mother, right? And she basically she unlocks her unlocks her like she was unlocked to where she can she can uh, uh, sense and hear everything. Everywhere, all at once. <laughs> it, it, the title is literally the whole movie. Everything, everywhere, all at once. That's literally the plot of the movie, bro. And she unlocks her into where she can. She's like her now. She can see all this. I skipped like a big portion, but yeah, she she did that. And it's like um, coming to find out, other hers have been killed off, and the people that were trying to get her. Like the, the the variation of her husband that came and said, yeah, they're trying to kill you. They can. It was it's I believe it was his organization. I don't know if that was confirmed or not, but it was. It, it seems like every variation of her wanted to help the daughter, and the organ the organization is like over the whole uh, device. Uh, I don't know. I forgot what they call, but it's like over the like basically trying to like against her, stop her from like destroying reality, or whatever. And he's like, and uh, he's like, nah, we, we can't let you do that and shit like that. And it was, it was one, it was something that her, what is it, her, 
I think it's her dad. Yeah, it's her dad. It's a variation of her dad from the earth where she created the device, where the device comes from. And she's like, and he he's like, yeah, she's just as stubborn as the other, as the other as the other versions of her. And I'm like, and when I heard that, I'm like, okay, so y'all have been killing her. It's not the dark. Y'all kill her. <laughs> like I, it's like y'all be. It might be a little bit of mixture of both, but that's what I got from it. And then. So the daughter's showing her, you know, unlocks her, shows her uh, basically what she's experienced, bro. And it's crazy because it's like you see all that shit and you see old girl. She's she's basically getting on the same page as uh, as her as her daughter. And she's like, yeah, like shit really don't matter. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you could have been this could have been that, and, you know, like Basically, she got over just like her daughter is over it. Her daughter is just over the whole shit, like the being able to sense everything on that shit. And this is the part where I'm kind of fuzzy on. I followed it as close as I could, but I I gotta watch it again. Basically, her daughter condensed everything that that she didn't. I believe that she didn't understand, or that she was what was it. Or what was unknown or something. I forgot I forgot what she said something before she did it. She explained it. But she basically condensed it down to like this giant ass uh black hole, right? And she called she called it a bagel, but it, it's just it, it looks like a black hole to me. She condensed down to like a giant black hole, right? And her and the mother about to go through it, right? And she's literally she's constantly going back from that moment with the daughter to Another another version of her on another earth that's like what is with her husband that didn't hook up with her husband, right? And her husband is like throughout the movie, her husband is like so loving and caring. And she's like, "Are you okay? Are you okay?" Like he literally wants what's best for her. He literally give his gives his life for her. He, it's even this one scene, bro. It's even this one scene. He he uh, she stabbed him. I think she stabbed him. Or some something like that. He he got back up and shielded. Was trying to shield her from the people that were trying to kill her. And I was like, "Yo, like this this dude on a different level." Yeah, I know some of y'all be like, I know some of y'all be like, "Man, that nigga sent me. Shut your ass up, man. You don't know nothing about nothing." But yeah, and it's crazy because she the the kind of the earth where she changed her mind about going through with the daughter. Is the same one where she told she told her other she told her husband she was like my life was so good without you like she she told this to this nigga's face she was like my life was amazing without you and I was and you see the husband he's like hurting and shit like that bro but before she goes through to the hole she go she's still going you know because she's still going back and forth right. Cause it's still it's still everything everywhere all at once. She's going back and forth, so she goes back to where she's like a, a martial art, a martial art. Uh, what am I trying to say? Like martial artist celebrity. There you go. That's what I'm trying to say. She's like a you know she's Hollywood and all that shit, right? Her husband's very successful. I forgot what he does. He's very successful. Does well for him for herself. And they meet up again, and and he was like. Yeah, you know, I got this, I got this. You know, we both doing well, but I'm still, I'm still not happy, and shit like that. And they show, they do it when they like come up with a um, a new variation of her. They introduce a new variation. They show what change made it to where she got to where she was. The original, she went, she left with um. She 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 left and married. Her husband, right? She like she like ran away with him, kind of left her family. This one didn't leave the family, and uh, and the husband just you know husband carried on because she they never got married. This one didn't leave the family. She's like a martyr, a martial artist celebrity, and they uh they're they're talking, they're talking, um and he, he's like, that's crazy, you know. It's like, yeah, we doing so good for ourselves. I'm still lonely. He's like. And and then you know since her she she has the conscience she knows they were married on another earth and she and you know ran a laundry mat and we're and you know we're married and shit and we're together and he said and the husband literally says he's like uh, I would have I would have loved to be with you 
run, uh, running a laundromat and worrying about bills. He said, I would have loved to to be there in that situation just because he was with, he would have been with her. And um, that comes full circle because that's what's that's inevitably and inevitably. I'm sorry, I'm trying to speak. That stops her from going through with the daughter. She's like, she's like, no, like you know, you can't can't just you know give up. Basically, you can't just quit, quit, give up. And she's like, going um, it's through multiple earths. She's like, fall chasing the daughter, trying to catch her and shit like that. And the daughter's like, no. Like the daughter, the daughter's like no, 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 no. She's chasing her, and they get back to their earth, right? The well, the original of this movie. <laughs> I don't know which earth really is the original, but the the earth that we started on, the you know that, that we following. They get back to that one, and she's like, and she's following the daughter and shit like that. And the daughter's like, she's like, stop, you know, stop chasing me. I'm tired because she's been. It's, you know, because she's experienced, and I'll say it again, everything, everywhere, all at once. And she's sick of it. It's literally, it's literally driving, it's literally making her, like, miserable. And she's sick of it, so she wanted to, like, end the suffering and shit like that. And the daughter's like, it doesn't, you know, and the, the mom's like, takes a page out of the dad's and is like, it doesn't matter. You know, uh, I don't care if we're both like this now, I just want to be... I just want to be with you. You know what I'm saying? Like, she just want to be with her. She just want to have her daughter. You know? And it doesn't matter. that Because both of them are dealing with it now. You know what I'm saying? She, the mother's dealing with it and the daughter's dealing with it. And so she, she's basically like, we know we'll deal with it together. As long as we're together, it'll be fine. And she's like, so she finally breaks through their daughter and shit like that. And they get it. And, um... There's a, there's a lot of, like, sub... Kind of, like, subplots and shit like that. But... So they, basically everything's okay and shit like that, you know. And then the wife, you know, basically starts to love her, like, love her husband again. Not that she was out of love with him, but it's just like she was just being, like, overly mean and, like, not as loving as a wife should be. But, yeah. So that, I skip, I did skip a lot, but it's like, oh, sh bro. One thing I want to touch on, fighting scenes, fire. Choreography, fire. Um, what you doing? What am I trying to say? Visual effects, fire. This one scene, I'm not going to spoil it. This one scene, bro. It's, it's so simple. They don't even talk in the scene. It's just subtitles. But it's so fire, bro. Best scene of the movie, though, I got to give it. And it was like, when, this scene, I was like, okay, this shit is like on a different level. She literally... What is it? She literally is using every single technique that she's that she's learned from the other variations of herself on other on the, the the people in her way to get to her daughter. It's like a little stairway, stairwell, and people are all over all up uh, over the, the the stairwell trying to stop her from getting to the daughter. Right. So she's using. I remember this one. This it was this one. This one earth. She was a. Uh, she was a shelf and shit like that, and she started like using, using the weapon like a shelf would, like you know what I'm saying, like with like with the fucking um, spatula and shit. She started using that shit. Um, then she went back to the martial artist, and I forget it was another one too. She used, and the thing, the crazy thing about it is that, like, the trigger, like the way she subdued some of these people going up the stairs. It's, it was like their thing on the other earth. Like, if they were on this earth, that that's what would activate them. Like, activate the consciousness, the consciousness from the other earth. And she knows, she knows the trigger because she's been to all of, you know, she's experienced all of it. Once again, she's experienced everything, everywhere, all at once. And so she uses all that knowledge that she has. And she like sub she subdues this one dude. He has a kink or whatever. Uh, I think what is it BDSM or whatever like whatever it's called. He has a kink, and you know so she ties him up and she, she ties him up and shit like that. And that like you know that that kind of like what is it? What am I trying to say here? 
not set straight. That kind of like bring. I don't know what word I'm trying to do, but it, it subdue isn't a good word to use there because it's more than that. It's not like she subdued. She freed them. She didn't subdue them. It's like she freed them from whatever like uh, consciousness was currently in control of their body, right? It's like she freed, like basically, like she over over uh, rode the system that she created. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man. Um, certain it, the the movie uh, movie's fire, flames, bro. I think this is like like as far as like a multiverse concept. Like I said, this is this is like on some shit like Tenant, bro. Tenant with the time travel shit. With the rules and all that shit laid out, and, and you see what it is. It's a, the execution is fire. It, it's it's not really a lot of, it's not really a lot of plot holes. It, it's not really a lot of plot holes that I can think. There might not be no plot holes actually. Now I'm thinking about it. Now there could be some things you question about, like how, how, about how does that do that? You know, you know, and and and, and, and that's for interpretation, I guess. But man, this movie is fire. I de listen. I tell you. What I touched on in this review, even though I did have some, I did spoil some, made some big things. That's probably not even, like, what I said total probably is not even an hour of the movie. Look, this shit was, bro, this shit was rewarding. This shit was good. This shit. It just, it's been, it's been a really long time that, like, a non-superhero movie, I have going to see a movie and it's like, this was like, up there with the quality, you know what I'm saying? Like, like this is a quality movie. It's been a while since I didn't like. Yeah, I I, I posted the ambulance review, the Sonic the Hedgehog, and shit like that. But it's like those movies are enjoyable, entertaining, funny, all that shit. This movie was like that times ten. And is I will say I'll even dare say it's better than the majority of the superhero movies that have been let like. Release in one more thing. No multiverse movie coming out this year will even will touch this. It will even touch it, bro. It won't touch it because one thing y'all got to understand: Marvel and even even DC when they get their shit together, they start making uh, parallel Earth universe and multiverse joints. That they won't come close because all of them. Like leads for moving the movie Marvel. You literally, you literally got Doctor Strange, Multiverse of Madness. Well, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You got No Way Home, leading into Doctor Strange, Multiverse of Madness, leading into Thor: Love and Thunder, leading into Black Panther, leading into what is it, Ant Man, Quantum Mania, and then you got uh, I'm pretty sure I, I might have missed one. And then you got the Marvels. It's like all of that. Feeds into one another. And this one literally just is it's a start and finish. They start the concept right here and they finish it. And they finish it well. They execute it well. Man, I, I might have to make another fucking video on this shit, bro. I gotta go watch this shit again. But yeah, man, this shit, fire. If you haven't watched it, do yourself a favor. And do bro, just just watch it, bro. Just watch it. Now, 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 I know I'm a movie fiend, and I'm like, and I enjoy most movies. And, and you like, Jalen, Jalen, you said, you said this movie was good. That shit was trash. It's like, okay, cool. That's 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 good, but try to find a bad review about this movie. I I don't, I don't know what that shit got on, on Rotten Tomatoes, the ninety something, whatever shit. What is it? Certified fresh. This shit is fresh. <laughs> And it is what we need right now, bro. Just watch the movie. It's a good watch with anybody. Um, appreciate y'all tuning in, man. I love the support. We're going to keep on pushing. I'm going to start experimenting. We're going to start getting some more uh, higher quality videos. I know y'all sick of just the slideshow type shit. Um, but yeah, man. Appreciate y'all. Uh, follow me on Twitch. Till next time. I'm out. Peace.